I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. Just in time. They've already started. Learned long ago, we gave King Bronn back to the sea. Today, our morning ends. Today, by the grace of the gods and the clans, a new ruler takes the crown. Let us swear her fealty. I know some would see another in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream. Ceres! 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 Said so. Liable to puff out her chest. But you do her good now I think of it. We showed Lugos. That's most important. Did you see that rage grip him? I thought he'd burst. Yeah. Surprised to see him in that much of a half, actually. Our clans have been butting heads, chests, bellies forever. It's the lay of the land. Looks to me you're near bursting with pride. <laughs> if only you knew, Wolf. Tell me, what other Jarl can boast children like mine? <laughs> Shame their mother didn't live to see this. Ceres will make a good queen. Maybe she can finally unite the clans. Let's hope. And if not, she'll always have me and Yalma. If the need arises, we'll take up arms for her. Congratulations. You'll make a great queen. Thank you. Wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. What's the new Queen of Skellica planning? Um, to listen, learn, and listen again. Then we'll see. Good plan. I must unite the clans. I'd rather avoid war, but if Nilfgaard aims to attack, we must repel them together. Drummond folk might be a problem. I saw Lugos during the ceremony. Furious, to say the least. There's always been strife between our clans. But I must try and talk to him. Just might bring the end. Keep my fingers crossed. Farewell. <laughs> 